the Mile High City, Denver, Colorado. It's the site for the Heat. You won't find a more dangerous player than Kyle Lowry. He'll lead them into battle as they prepare for a fight with the Nuggets. Heat, Nuggets, and we'll be right back for the tip-off. Welcome all. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports. We've got some NBA action coming up for you. Hi folks, Brian Anderson here, alongside two fantastic analysts, Grant Hill and Brent Berry at the table, and our reporter, Allie LaForce. Allie, it's all yours. Well, Denver's Michael Malone learned the game from his father, who was also an NBA coach. Mike said, quote, it all started with my father's impact as a mentor. He actually told me not to go into coaching. I should have listened. This is a crazy job. Brian, you buying that? Not for a minute, Allie. He loves this game too much. Great stuff there. Thank you. And let's check Miami's starting lineup. Struess and Butler out on the perimeter. Caleb Martin out there with Bam out of bio. And it's Lowry in at the point. And for Denver, Murray and Caldwell Pope are the backcourt pairing. Porter Jr. and Gordon at the three and the four. And it's Jokic in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. Now look at this Denver team and you just expect them to be good for a long time. Obviously MVP and Jokic but their best players all young signed the long term deals. They should be able to compete. So the Nuggets with the tip. Outside Porter. Pass to Murray. Here's Caldwell Pope. He's guarded by Martin. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Yeah, great job by the Nuggets putting together this core. They're set up for success for a while, Brad. Well, we saw that potential BA come out in the bubble getting to the conference finals. And now it's about getting key players back to health and at full capacity. And if they do that, I expect them to make the noise that uh, the Western Conference wants to avoid. Shooting two. First free throw is good. Think about well-constructed teams and themes that go with that. The Miami Heat certainly leap to mind. Their front office has just done a great job of assembling a deep roster that fits their mentality. So he gets them both. Well, you would know the depth of the Miami bench is certainly felt in the strength of their second unit. Yeah, when the starters sit down, Miami doesn't lose much. There's a tremendous combination of skill and playability that they lean on throughout the course of the regular season. And the bench certainly makes big contributions with their minutes. Second foul. Contavious Caldwell Pope. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. against Murray and there's the lob and finished off by Adebayo that's everything you want there Bam Adebayo up there vertical good hands and the big throw down outside Murray pass to Porter outside Murray here's Jokic 11 feet out and he hits it Jokic's decision making is absolutely elite Taking that catch and shoot that time. Butler passes to Adebayo. Here's Lowry. And that one's on target from the wing. Goes Willing passers. Ben unselfish Adebayo. play. You have to appreciate this kind of offense. Pass to Caldwell Pope. And here's Porter. Butler covering. And there's the whistle. The illegal screen is the call. You're not going to fool the officials too often on an illegal screen. Yeah, everybody saw that one. That was pretty blatant there. The Nuggets making a switch here. Highlands checked in. First quarter of play with about a minute and a half gone by. Outside Struess. Back to Butler. On the wing, Struess. And it's going to be a three-second call. Who's ball? Nuggets ball! And 
it's the Nuggets with the ball. Down low. Murray shot is good. And Murray getting it going on the inside that time. Around the trees, still scored. Yeah, everybody knows that that Bones nickname is going to stick for quite a while. But don't let it fool you. This guy is not afraid to take it inside and challenge bigger defenders. Now here's Lowry. And here's Butler. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. It's on Nikola Jokic. And with Highland, the fearlessness he brings. It's what makes the fans love him, Brent. Yeah, B.A., I like the Bones nickname, by the way. But this energy, it's infectious. And that's what Bones brings to the game. And when he gets hot, this guy tends to stay hot for a long time. First free throw is good. Well, when we talk home court advantage, you think the Nuggets have the best in the NBA? I think so, B.A., and it has to do with geography. Denver is at altitude, and that's hard on your body. Trust me, I know. And they're isolated from the rest of the league, so it always is a long trip out there as well. He's perfect from the line this time. And you can tell he's feeling confident right now at the line, and when he's on, he can be lights out. Outside Porter. Back to Murray. It's Jokic. High post. Outside Murray. Pass to Gordon. Back to Murray. And it falls. Two for three from the field so far. I love this approach. Getting him involved early, and it's already paying off. Well, he's going to just keep going now. That's early confidence for him. With the explosive leaping ability, he's able to play center despite being undersized. Outside Murray. To the wing, right side. Six to shoot. Pass to Jokic. The shot, no good. Oh, great D that time from Adebayo. Murray against Struess. Now here's Adebayo. Great start so far. Three of three in this one. Well, Bam Adebayo so efficient right there. He picks a smart shot that fits his skill set. And that was the mobile one drive. Low resistance to the finish line. And I love the way he played downhill on that drive. Love the attack mentality in a close game. Now here's Murray. Jokic with it. Over out of bio. Nice spin off the left rim and in. Jokic has got his second basket. And this is where you appreciate Jokic as a big man and that touch from that distance. Time called here. Miami decides to talk it over. You think about some of the great young centers in this league, but when it comes to making everyone around him better, Jokic is the man. Jokic. Green comes in for Gordon. Brown, he's checked in for Porter Jr. And it's Smith in for Murray. So Miami going with an almost entire new group here. Yurt Sevens checked in for Bam Adebayo. Oladipo comes in for Martin. Tyler Heroes checked in for Struess. And Vincent is subbed in for Lowry.
Outside, Brown. Back to Smith. Butler against Green. Pass to Highland. Clock at six. In the first. Two minutes. From the high post. <laughs> Left side, Brown. Get some space and parries the jumper. Can't talk enough about the subtleties in that setup right there. The assist, really the key to that entire sequence. Pass to Oladipo. And here's your seven. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. Oh, what tremendous focus to absorb the contact and find a way there to finish. One shot. The Nuggets trail. To the paint. Here's Najee. And the layup is good. Just owning the painted area. If it's working, no need to change. The Heat have gone 5 of 5 in this quarter. Solid. Pass to Vincent. Now Oladipo. Now quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first point of the game. Here's your 7. No good on the 3. The Nuggets have gone 6 of 9 and finding their rhythm now. Smith outside. Here's Highland. Soft touch off the glass. Terrific job by Smith to dish that one off to his open teammate right there. There's 45 seconds left in the opening quarter. Hero outside. Pass to Oladipo. And the three-pointer goes. And that's what they want to do. Get him open looks early. Here's Highland. He's guarded by Hero. Smith finds Brown. Here's Najee. Takes the three. Oladipo with the rebound. Hero with it. Shoots from 14. No good on the shot. Well, he's a guy they count on to produce from the mid-range. He doesn't miss too many open looks from there. Some great action here early as we end the first quarter in a tie. And we'll be back in just a minute with the start of the second quarter. teams tonight keeping things pretty even on the scoreboard so far all right guys what do you think about the nuggets here in this one well it's pretty obvious i mean cashing in on extra opportunities that's how they built this early lead working the offensive glass that sometimes comes from predictable shots from your offense and they've been opportunistic here and the league has redefined the rules a bit regarding the gather step players getting more leeway what do you think about that well i think guys ba are getting a little more creative in practicing that I mean, they, they will adjust to the rule that is one thing we've seen through the years with nba players and so in the off season if you can find a way to take advantage of a half a step more in order to gain advantage on a defender i'm all for it until they change the rule back setting the floor for miami lowry and hero are the backcourt Duncan Robinson is out there with Caleb Martin. And it's Adebayo in at the five, down low. So it's Denver now, following the bucket by the Heat. Four on the clock. Jacks up a three. Offensive board. Jokic off with the layup. 
The Heat with the lead. Now here's Adebayo. Give him eight points now. Pass to Hero. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. It's on Nikola Jokic. Hero right now working himself into a lather, staying aggressive. Drawing the defense's attention. Tyler here. And a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Heat. They've done a great job facilitating so far. So moving the rock and finding the open man, just great selfless basketball. Now getting to the inside is really important, but it's how close you can get to the basket. It feels like these guys are all around the rim in their attack tonight. And the first one at the line is good. And, and Hero, one of those guys you just rely on coming in and giving you that offensive pop. He does a lot of things for his team on that end of the floor. And so Hero nails both of them. And we're now about a minute into the second quarter of play. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Pass to Porter. Yo, yo, yo. Here go, now here's Gordon. The three is up. And Hero grabs the board. Ooh, he missed an easy chance to put some points on the board. He won't get a much better look at that kind of shot again here probably tonight. To the middle. Here's Adebayo. He's locked in. Drains his fifth That's shot in as many attempts. Tyler good job here. by Tyler just finding the open teammate and showing some good awareness. Now a timeout, timeout called by Denver. And the players take this opportunity to get some Gatorade. Getting some fluids in you is so important during these timeouts. Get fresh. Keep those batteries charged. Yeah, without proper hydration, a player can completely run out of gas down the stretch of a ball game. And that's something that none of these guys can afford to have happen. If you're going to battle all the way to the finish, you have to be hydrated. Fans, please welcome to the floor your Nuggets dance team. for Miami. Second quarter, a little over a minute and a half in. Outside Porter. Murray against Lowry. The drive by Murray. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. his first personal foul. Well, don't forget about Jamal Murray. This guy is back. He's as good as any other point guard in the Western Conference. Taking two shots. That one's off. You know, with Murray, he's an efficient, high-volume scorer with a complete offensive game, Brent. No doubt, B.A. Scores at all three levels, has a great handle. And I'll tell you what, this is about recovery. Jamal getting back, being focused to return to the game that has eluded him from injuries the past couple years. He is focused. And the second free throw is good. But Jamal Murray at his size, the one impressive thing that stands out to me is that he will willingly go right at the defense. Robinson passes to Lowry. 
Quarter two in about two minutes in. Pass to Martin. Here's Adebayo. Hey, he's now six for six. He is cooking right now. Bam grabs the board, and then Bam knows what to do. Denver has gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. Outside quarter. Up top, Gordon. Outside, Murray. Pass to Jokic. Six on the shot clock. Drops in the three. Jokic has got seven points. Think about all the things Jokic provides as a big man. And now the seven-footer knocking down threes. That's tough. Murray against Lowry. Again, the Heat oh. score. We saw Lowry that time just call for the pick, get himself in a position where he could score. Outside Porter. Pass to Caldwell Pope. Three-pointer, no good. For Miami, they've gone a terrific four of five here in the second quarter. Now Robinson, he's guarded by Porter. Here's Adebayo. 12 points for him. And here's Lowry. Three shots, three baskets. Great efficiency so far. Lowry showcasing his ability to do damage on the inside. Pass to Caldwell Pope. Porter with it. Gordon, left side. On the wing, Caldwell Pope. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. Max Struess picks one up. Man, he made sure to get his money's worth on that foul. At the line for your Nuggets, Contavious Caldwell Pope. At the line for two. Two. First one falls for him. And a new group getting ready for the Nuggets. Najee, he's checked in for Jokic. Green comes in for Gordon. Brown, he's checked in for Michael Porter. And it's Smith in for Murray. So Miami going with an almost entire new group here. Yurt Sevens checked in for Martin. Jimmy Butler comes in for Robinson. Victor Oladipo is checked in for Struess. And Vincent is subbed in for Lowry. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. The Heat have gotten five of their first six attempts to fall in the second. Pass to Vincent. And here's your Seven. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Outside Butler. Two minutes. Inside, shot clock at six. Out of That's out of bounds. Miami keep will keep it. Nice deflection the there. The really the trying to disrupt their offensive oh, flow. Yeah, I appreciate the work right now on the defensive end. Highland, he's checked in for Caldwell Pope. We've got 155 left in the first half. Here's your seven. And that one's good with extra effort on the glass. Your seven's got five now. The hard work on the offensive glass. You can see the coaching staff timeout, rise timeout. up Denver and calls. clap for that effort. Now a timeout called by Denver. And one thing I've learned through the years is no matter the situation, there are always adjustments you can make. And not just there to pump up or to discipline players. you got to make sure that the coach makes the proper adjustments and has his team in the right mindset to carry it out.
Here's Najee. Here's Highland. Minute 32 left in the first half. Nuggets. Jeff Green. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. And it's Miami's ball. They're on a 14 to 6 run. Outside Butler. Back to Oladipo. Pass to Vincent. Six on the shot clock. Oladipo outside. Shoots over Brown. Here's your seven. And he was no, fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. That's his second personal foul. I like that. I mean, some second physical team. play inside. He's not about to give up shooting any easy hand. baskets. Umer Yurtsevich at the line for two. Free throw, no good. And the Heat making a change here. Heroes checked in. So he comes up empty, missing both. Denver has gone one of four from three point land here in the second. Smith with it, now guarded by Butler. Smith against Butler. Oh, he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. First personal foul. 13 foul. At the line for Denver. Ish Smith. Two shots. That one misses. That one misses. A chance at a two for one if they'd like. And I really can't see why they wouldn't. Pass to Vincent. Shoots from 12. And that one hits the back iron. The Nuggets have gotten nothing to go out of five attempts so far this quarter. Smith. Not going to go that time. Ooh, some solid defense from Oladipo. Shot clock and game clock. One second differential. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. He took the contact and had an opportunity to train it. Shooting for Miami. Tyler Hero, two shots. Drops a first. And so Hero nails both of them. Denver has gone one of four from three-point land here in the second. 
Here's Highland. With one on the clock. It's Hero's quickness on defense right now that's helping him to be effective. And so it's Miami earning this break in the action. Up 10. Just pounding the painted area. That's helped him build an advantage. We're coming right back. Don't go anywhere. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello again, folks. Ernie Johnson here with Kenny the Jet Smith and Shaquille O'Neal. It's the NBA on 2K Sports, and let's talk the first half. Bam Adebayo putting in some incredible work. He had 12 points, four rebounds, and one assist. He came in with something to prove tonight after having a very tough outing in their last game. Let's hear from you, Shaq, on the Heat first half. Well, they've shown a lot of discipline at the offensive end. It's not about getting the good shots, it's about getting the good shots. And if you want to know how that approach is working, just check out their field goal percentage. Kenny, what was your takeaway on Denver? Well, it's never fun. We play against the team that's on fire. This team was on fire. They showed effort on defense, but it didn't matter. They couldn't get the stops. I don't think the opponent could sustain this kind of shooting. And that'll do it for us. The third quarter about to begin with Kevin Harlan standing by. We'll catch you on the flip side, my brother. And we played through the first half. Plenty of basketball left in this one. It's been a clinic out there by Bam Adebayo. Through two quarters of play, he's been an excellent source of points. Yeah, he's, he's shouldering the load right now and looking really comfortable while he's doing it. Heat shooting 67% for the game. Just outstanding. Porter Jr. and Gordon at the three and the four. Murray and Caldwell Pope are the backcourt pairing. And it's Jokic in at the center position. That's the five to begin the second half for Michael Malone. Lowry, good. Another shot right in the lane. That's been their M.O. this evening. Outstanding dribble drive. And that replay was brought to you by Mobile One. Yeah, and with a finish like that, you know he's looking to extend the lead and put this game out of reach. Outside Porter. Back to Murray. Puts up a three. On target from range. Murray's got eight. Well, a polished score and good recognition as Jamal Murray understood the timing that he needed to catch and fire. So much NBA talent like Jamal Murray out of Canada, specifically the province of Ontario. Yeah, very true. And I think that's because guys like Murray, born in the late 90s, they grew up with the NBA in Toronto. And Jamal and others have been inspired by the Raptors. The Nuggets trail. Second half of basketball, just over a minute played so far. But for Michael Porter Jr., no one has argued about his talent. It's been about health, friend. Well, the top recruit back in his high school class. Michael Porter Jr. Michael had back surgery his first year of college. Slid in the draft because of it. Has had a few more issues here, but Denver believes. They believe that they're going to get the best out of MPJ, and I hope we all see it. First free throw is good. And Michael Porter Jr., just one of those guys that has a versatile scoring menu. Terrific at executing at all three levels. Off on that one, so he goes one out of two at the line. The Heat with the lead. Lowry outside. And he lobs it up. Oh, what a nice defensive play to disrupt the lob. Here's Caldwell Pope. Misses the three. And for the Heat, their shooting continues to impress. 65% from the field. 
Outside Struess. Down low. Ooh, good finish at the rack off the slick feed. Lowry's got 10 points. Want to score in the NBA? Picks can really force the D to make tough choices. Outside Murray. On the wing, Caldwell Pope. Six to shoot. Rebound by the Heat. Adebayo's got his sixth rebound on the night. Lowry, right side. Pass to Struess. Let's it go from deep. Offensive rebound. Adebayo. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. It's on Nikola Jokic. Adebayo on the inside knows he has to go up hard. He's going to get hit. And he forces the D to do it that time. Taking two shots. This is the free throw. And the Otto Bio experiment has been pretty awesome to watch just because it's gone nuclear. All the skills and his hard work paying off now. Robinson, he's checked in for Miami. He hits the second from the line. The Nuggets have gone just one of three in the second half. Outside Murray. On the wing, Caldwell Pope. Robinson defending. From 13, jump shot is good. Caldwell Pope's got six points. And no one really crashing down on the backside. A breakdown defensively. A chance here to catch up with Allie from the sideline. Thanks, guys. The NBA last season celebrated its 75th anniversary and announced the 75 greatest players in NBA history, gathering the living greats during the All-Star break. A lot of history, but Commissioner Silver said, we're a pretty young league when you think about it. Brian, I guess it's all relative. Yeah, indeed. Thanks for that, Allie. The Nuggets have gotten two of four shots to go since the break. Pass to Jokic. Opening close, and he drops it in. He's got nine. Such a good handle for a big guy. Nothing super fancy, but efficient. Butler against Porter. Butler passes to Adebayo. Here's Lowry. Fires for three. Hey, he's now six for six. He is cooking right now. Well, the shots continue to Denver fall, and Kyle's going to find a way to keep getting them up. Time called here. The Nuggets decide to talk it over. Fans, get crazy. It's T-shirt time.
and the Nuggets will go for a different look here. Green's checked in for Gordon. Brown comes in for Porter Jr. Highland, he's checked in for Caldwell Pope. And it's Smith in for Jamal Murray. So Miami going with an almost entire new group here. Geert Sevens checked in for Bam Adebayo. Oladipo comes in for Martin. Tyler Heroes checked in for Robinson. And Vincent is subbed in for Lowry. The screener was leaning a bit right there. His feet may not have been planted. Pretty obvious call by the officials. Gotta hold firm or you're gonna get a call. Now here's Two Hero. Remaining in the third. Two minutes. Pass to Oladipo from the arc. And the Heat, Victor another Oladipo. three. Oladipo finding his range now. The Nuggets have gone three of five from the field in this third quarter. Smith outside. Out to the right wing. Now here's Jokic. Plenty of space. And Hero grabs the board. That's a shocker there. Did not expect him to miss from that range. He's got to be shooting close to 60% from it. Bruce Brown. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. A chance to catch up on some numbers here. The scoring breakdown for Miami. What stood out to me was their passing. They moved the ball effortlessly and have been able to find those holes in the defense. Two and shots. it seemed like throughout this game, right after the jump ball, they've just been feeling it from distance, getting all the looks they want and continuing to take advantage of that three-point line. The first free throw is good. You don't become this good in this league unless you put in a lot of hard work. And there's some evidence that Jimmy Butler has done that through the years. And the Nuggets making a change here. Najee's checked in. Butler hits them both. A minute and a half left in the third. Pass to Highland. Back to Smith. Here's Najee. He's covered by your seven. Smith outside. And here is Green. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. What a look from Smith there. Ish with the dish. Here's Vincent. There's 57 seconds left in the third. He creates such a great opportunity right at the rim, and he just can't get it to go, even with the defense not really a factor. Smith with it. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Back to Brown. Pass to Highland. There's the triple. Miami grabs the miss. Good seven's got five rebounds in the game. Hey, yo, right here. Here's Vincent. There's 18 seconds left in the third quarter of the game. The shot by Oladipo, no good. Here's Helen. Butler covering. Let's it fly. Denver foul. Jeff Green. That's his third personal foul. Second team foul. Checking in the game for your Nuggets. Nikola Jokic. One second left. Doesn't go for him. And so it's the Miami Heat up 15 points as this quarter concludes. They just can't miss right now. Every shot they're taking you assume is going in. We'll be right back. And while we have a chance, let's go to our State Farm assist of the game. And the winner today coming from an unlikely position. It's the big fellow with the sweetest pass of the day. You know, anytime a guy's in the post and the teammates know he's unselfish, great player movement can create an opportunity just like that. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four. Setting the floor for the Heat. 
Lowry and Hero are the backcourt. Bam Adebayo is out there with Caleb Martin. And it's Oladipo in a small forward. And Caldwell Pope gets it to go. Now sometimes there's passes and then there's precision passes. Murray with one of those there. Oladipo outside. Back to Lowry. And there's a three-second violation. Three-second violation. Denver ball. Denver basketball. Here's Jokic. Pass to Murray. From deep. It's hauled in by the Heat. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Hero, left side. The Heat rebound. Lowry, the pass to Oladipo. Four on the clock. Here's Hero. That one's wide left. Denver has gone one of two from deep in this quarter. Here's Caldwell Pope. Pass to Murray. And he banks in the layup. Meeting the defense with a tenacious will to score. Murray giving you that effort. And no lack of aggression on that move. Good for the 2K drive. You know, that's the kind of play that can really start a run. He knows a little momentum can get them back even. Now here's Hero. Oladipo outside. Now here's Hero. To the paint. Here's Martin. There's the block. What a swat by Aaron Gordon. To the inside. Caldwell Pope. He's guarded by Hero. Here's Jokic. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That's his first person. The officials were right on top of that. At the line for your Nuggets, Nikola Jokic. At the line for two. And he makes a first. Well, it's so hard to try to defend Joker. You never know what it is that he's going to do. And because of that great vision, he's got great counter. Struess, he's checked in for Oladipo. And he makes both free throws. Two minutes gone by here in the fourth. Miami calls timeout. They're just giving away a run right now. The question is, can they stop the tie? Hard to say right now. At this point, I've seen the coaches run through two or three iterations of defense. Is there a fourth? I'm not sure. from the sideline, Ali LaForce. Over that last break, I got a chance to hear what Eric Spolstra said to the team, and he implored them to be patient at the offensive end. He wants to use every second of the shot clock. He said, quote, if we take care of the ball, we take our time, and play D, this game is ours. And Ali, thanks. 
Now here's Martin. Over Gordon. And again, the Heat missing. The Nuggets have gotten half of their attempts to fall in the fourth. Two for four now. They get the rebound. And Gordon with the big finish. Aaron Gordon's athleticism can show up in other areas. That time, track down the offense board. Lowry, the pass to Hero. Over two and a half minutes in the books here in the fourth. Off the mark, and the drought continues. The Nuggets have got three of six shots to go in this fourth quarter. Here's Caldwell Pope. He's guarded by Lowry. Down low, Jokic. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. That's his second personal It goes on Bam out of bio. Just have to stay down on any kind of pump fake once Jokic got him up in the air. He had him. Two shots. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for the Nuggets. Well, the coaching staff has to love what they're seeing on offense. There's so many assists because how this team is moving the ball. Well, it's one thing in a game to do a great job of drawing fouls, but going to the free throw line and delivering, that's another. Jimmy Butler's checked in for Hero. And he's good on the second. And we're about three minutes into the fourth now. Lowry finds Martin. Lowry with it. Defended by Murray. Nikola Jokic grabs the miss. Jokic has got seven rebounds in the game. Outside Murray. Let's it go. Offensive board. Another shot. Jokic, no good. Miami's gotten three of their seven threes to find the net in this matchup. A shot to stop the drought. And Butler with the finish. And the Heat lead by seven. Pretty good body movement and control. As Jimmy Butler's agility got him to where he wanted to be. Here's Murray. And the lamp is good off the glass. How about Murray stepping up? Poise for this young player. And the Heat shooting around 50% of the game so far. Outside Struess. Butler up top. He's guarded by Porter. Here's the break. Here's Caldwell Pope. Cash. Assisting on the play was Porter. And now just a three-point Heat lead. They're doing the job on both ends. Getting stops and attacking offensive. Yeah, coaching staff probably loves this, just grinding out defensive possessions, which is helping them get back into their offensive flow. Time called here. Miami decides to talk it over. They're on top by three. 143 left in the fourth quarter of this one. to cool off hitting just about everything he looks at it doesn't matter who's guarding him he's had an answer for just about everyone One forty-three left to play in the fourth 
and he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. His first personal foul. Now, Jimmy Butler really loves this opportunity here. He's so comfortable in the highest of stressful situations. Let's see if he steps to the line and gets it done again. He drops the first one, and that gives him a four-point cushion. Hey, never one to shy away from the pressure. Jimmy with a huge opportunity at the line. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a five-point game. Perfect from the line. It's now a two-possession game. And here's Denver. They're on a 14-4 run. Right side, Murray. Jokic in the post. Counted by Adebayo. And they're going to count that bucket. And they'll send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. Defensive foul. Ben Adebayo. That's his third personal foul. Third team foul. At the line for your Nuggets, Nikola Jokic. Shooting one. Free throw drops for Jokic. Yeah, not the guy that you want to put at the line in these moments. He's not missing these. Outside Butler. Up and over Porter. Butler, good. Jimmy Butler. Butler's got six points in the quarter. Jimmy Butler is one of the respected guys when it comes to these moments to play in the clutch. Murray passes to Jokic. Over Adebayo. Adebayo grabs the board. Yeah, my expectations were that he was not going to miss that foot. He handles that kind of defense, especially on the inside. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. At the line for the Heat, Jimmy Butler shooting one. Denver has gone one of two from deep in this quarter. Murray passes to Jokic. He connects! Oh, and that cuts the lead to just five! He's simply staying aggressive right now, and Jokic is ready to shoot at the biggest moments. Butler double team. Gordon with a steal. Quarter against Butler. Murray. What a beautiful shot. Brings it within three. Yeah, this game is not over when Jamal Murray is still able to play. They'll probably slow things down now. Burn the clock while you have the lead. I like that. Butler passes to Lowry. Back to Butler. Just five to shoot. The Heat need to get one up in a hurry. It's deflected, and he stays with it. Struess's shot out, is off. Out. It's now a timeout called by Denver. They're down by three. Eight seconds left in the fourth. Guys, your thoughts? If they leave the arc open, take it. But it may be safer to get a quick two and then foul. Don't force something up. you got to be smart here.
the Heat making a change here. Heat substitution. Tyler here. And looking to even the score with a huge three. Well, you can bet that's what they're looking for this late in the game. They need that three. And an intentional foul there stops the clock. Yeah, just a must foul situation to stop the clock. Shooting for my out. Ben Alabama. At the line for two. He hits the first one, and that gives him a four-point cushion. And we've seen some moments where Bam has had to step up and be a leader in times like this, including going to the line in important moments. He hits both free throws here, and it's a five-point game. Taking care of business at the line, leaving this one out of reach. Time called here. The Nuggets decide to talk it over. They're behind by five. Three seconds left in the fourth quarter here. All right, guys, what do you think? Trying to extend this one, but it seems futile. Yeah, this is the classic too little, too late. The effort coming and not enough time for them to get back in it. They barely squeezed out the win here on the road. And B.A., the visiting team is always under some added pressure, but they made it work and got the win, whatever the margin may have been. All right, let's go courtside to Allie LaForce with our player of the game. Allie, it's all yours. Thanks, guys. Bam, a huge game for you. Is this just your own initiative, or is this something that your coaches and your teammates expect of you? Uh, it's coming from everybody. They want me to be more assertive and really try to lead this team. And it's mainly because of Jimmy. Jimmy really pushing me right now to uh, just be aggressive and keep doing what I'm doing. And, you know, I'm thankful for that and this team. Expectations are high for Bam. Thanks so much. All right, Allie, good stuff there. Thanks for that. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For Allie LaForce, Brent Berry, Grant Hill, and our entire 2K Sports crew, this is Brian Anderson signing off. And we'll see you next time.